I'm Andy Hilton of Recruit 757 here with Kansas City Chief Derek Noddy. Derek, fresh off of the draft, you're now an NFL player. How's it feel? Honestly, to me, it really feels the same. It's just the only thing I got to do is just focus on what I got to do. That's football right now. Well, you're used to working, that's for sure. That's one thing that got you to Florida State was work ethic. Have you seen anything, any major difference in terms of the work ethic that's expected from an NFL player versus that of a college player? I mean, as a college player, everything was kind of just routine. You had this to do, you had to do this, this, and this. You had the schedule set up. And on the league, everything was really on you. So I got put to myself with how much work I got put in. Like right now, during this little time off, I'm working out pretty much two times a day, Monday through Friday, just trying to get that much better for this training camp. Now, when the draft came along, and I know expectations are always high, how much of a relationship did you have with Kansas City versus anybody else that was recruiting you? Honestly, um, the real issue, they didn't really kind of talk to me, but I feel like that's how it is for certain teams. So they show that they let people know, notice that they're not interested in you, so they can grab you just like that. Which, when that happens, I'm really that I'm not really that um, hurt about it, but it is what it is. So what's, I mean, was it close with, I think you mentioned Seattle, Atlanta, Minnesota. There were some teams that you thought would have some interest in you that uh, it didn't work out. I mean, that's just kind of how the business goes. There's some teams, that, some players that really, really need at the time, so they're going to get them really quick. Sometimes they got to figure out when they'll be the best on the grab the kid. Sometimes it's too late. Like for the Chiefs, they traded up to get me, so they kind of, I guess they beat some people to the punch. Yeah. Well, it's a good thing you're in Kansas City. You've had, what, just a couple of weeks, a little bit of time in Kansas City at this point. Yeah, I was there for about uh, OTAs, working mini camps, just to get good grass work I do down there. It's pretty great. Now, thinking back, let's see, what was it, five or six years ago now, you were in a sim similar situation to this. High school, rising senior, looking to go to college. What advice can you share with these guys that are out here today? Honestly, it's really just... Put your best foot forward. Try to go 100% in everything you're trying to do. Like, if you want to be the best, anything you want to do, to put good, give it your all. Because anybody and everybody is watching. Even at this camp, even though it's not a uh, big time college camp, everybody's always reporting something in this day and age. So it's going to be out everywhere. So every time you go on this field, give it your all. Anything else you want to say? So, other than I'm, I'm happy to be home. <laughs> and you won't be home for long. Well, we're happy to have you here, Derek. Yeah. Thanks a lot for your time, man. No problem.